Let's get right to it. If you've read any threads out there or any advice on Quora or Reddit, or you watched any other experts on YouTube, you'd know one thing about the advice in the AI space. Most of it sucks. Why does it suck? Why are there so many people who have out such horrible advice? Let's talk about why most of the advice sucks. The worst advice is coming from those who have never worked in the real world. Here's some shitty advice from a researcher. Academics often give the worst advice. They've never worked in any real world machine learning or deep learning role, but want you to believe they know what they're doing. Why is this advice bad? Because in the real world, doers are the ones that end up as machine learning engineers. Most academics are pontificators. In the real world, if you don't have the skills to do the end-to-end -end machine learning pipeline, all the theory in the world is not going to help you get a job. Stay away from advice from academics. Next up are the college kids. They've taken a few courses in this space and now have all the answers to what the real world looks like. These kids are as bad as their professors. They spout the same nonsense as their professors because they've never worked in the real world, but love handing out horrific advice to you. So who do you listen to for world advice? Well, there's me, of course. Also, check out this answer by Mr. Strand, a friend of mine on Quora. Notice how he answers the question. He talks about the two most used frameworks, TensorFlow and PyTorch. He then breaks down what he likes and what he doesn't like and makes a case for PyTorch. This guy knows what he's talking about. The truth is, after reading through thousands of posts on Quora, there are only a handful of people that have worked in the AI space that post on Quora. Be very cautious about the advice you take. Your career is on the line and bad advice could set you back years. Look for people that have been in real world machine learning roles or the role you're interested in for at least 10 years. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And of course, have a great day. We'll see you soon.